So it's still the beginning of the new year, so I might as well take some time to talk about where this channel is heading in 2015. So I've been doing a lot of non-gaming, more community oriented videos lately. You know, it's been a filler month for gaming. I've had to lay down the framework for what I want to say and what I want to do. But one thing I do want to do is promote better discussion. Everyone is already well-versed in what I like and what I say and what my views and opinions are on certain topics and discussions, but it would be nice to hear different views, maybe more opposing views, hell, even views that agree with mine. Essentially what I'm saying is it would be nice to hear views from different people and not just me talking all the time expressing my own views. I would like to get back to Twitch streaming, but let's be serious, well then that's not going to happen. I'll say I'm going to stream, I'll say I'm going to do on Twitch, but it's not going to happen. I would like to do more Google Hangouts or live streams. I probably wouldn't mind that. Some of the channels I watch that may not be more well-known or popular with the rest of the people here. Icy Rhythms, Jelly Apostate Cow, Solid Rev, Anime Central, also known as Dub Central, also known as Shampoo, Phone 999, games I've been playing lately. Um, I just finished Dragon Quest IV. I am currently playing Dragon Quest V at the end of it. I have Dragon Quest VI. I have Dragon Quest IX to complete afterwards. Hopefully Square Enix is smart enough to localize Dragon Quest VII on 3DS, but, you know, it's Square Enix, so I highly doubt that. Maybe I'll have to go find a copy of the PlayStation 1 version of Dragon Quest VII. Dragon Quest, they're, um... They're solid games. They're really good games. I like them. They are insanely long, but I like them, and... Their length is probably the reason why you haven't seen me on Steam or Origin or anything like that lately. Because unlike some people in the community, especially the Xbox gamers in the community, I actually play games unlike you who are waiting for Cloud a year later and now you're waiting for DirectX 12. Always waiting for a new feature or a new SDK or a new update, but never really waiting for a game. Unless you're waiting for the Master Chief Collection to be fixed or something stupid like that. Well, as far as games I'm looking forward to in 2015 go, Batman Arkham Knight, The Witcher 3, the newly announced Fire Emblem 12, and let's talk about Fire Emblem 12. It better have PvP, it better have online PvP, two player, three player, four player battles like Advance Wars. Speaking of Advance Wars, where's my 3DS Advance Wars Nintendo? Come on, please. I've been waiting. And as far as Nintendo Direct goes, I'm not really a fan of Monster Hunter 4. I already own Majora's Mask on the N64. I don't care about Happy Meal toys. I'm interested in Codename Steam. I am. I can't deny that. The new Xenoblade looks good, but the character art style is Xenosaga ugly. I've never seen such ugly, lifeless looking character models ever in gaming. The Metroid Trilogy is also coming out to the Wii U, which hopefully means a new Metroid game will hopefully come out, and it will hopefully be a sequel to Fusion. I'm tired of all these integrals and all these fill-in games. Metroid Fusion came out 13 years ago, and the story still hasn't progressed past it since. Samus is now integrated with Metroid DNA, and the possibilities for a sequel to Fusion are pretty much endless when you think about it. Power Suit... Metroid DNA, Power Suit, Metroid Abilities, do it Nintendo, come on. As far as um, life goes right now, um, life is good, I mean, played basketball tonight, first time in seven months, obviously I was pretty much highly ineffective, but the endurance was still there even after four or five games, so that's good, I really can't complain. I just kind of have a problem with cutting and pivoting, and I guess that's natural after my injury to my knee and my leg, but... I mean, it is what it is. I mean, I could still bust out a couple hundred push-ups and sit-ups easy every day, but that's just me. I mean, I'm always going to be slender. I'm always going to be toned. I'm more of a, a cardio guy. I'm not into lifting weights and putting on bulk. That's obviously not good for my knees. You all obviously know that. But anyway, life is good. Work is good. Hopefully the scheduled vacations this year will pan out and be good. It's 2015. Let's have a good year.